Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and today we're going to do a hair video on how to go from looking like oh no to oh okay. So first things first, I'm going to wet my hair with water in a spray bottle to make sure that my hair is wet from root to end. Then I'm going to use a tangle brush to comb out my hair and make sure that there's no tangles and make sure that I can run my fingers through my hair. I'm going to do this to both sides of my hair to make sure that it is evenly wet throughout. I don't know about you guys, but for me, my hair has to be entirely wet in order for me to manage it and do natural styles. So that is why I'm using a lot of water and making sure that there are no tangles or anything like that. My hair has to be soaking wet. Once I'm done drenching my hair with water, I am going to, like I said, use a detangle brush to make sure that there are no tangles and no nappy naps. And then I'm going to section my hair into four sections. This way it is just easier to do and manage. And that way I won't miss any sections or any parts of my hair once I start putting product in it. Now that my hair is in four sections, I'm going to braid the back. This way the back will not get in the way when I start working on the front. And I like working on the front of my hair first because I like to twist my hair after I've put the product in. That way the product can set and my curls can look sh poppin'. And you know, I feel like the front of my hair matters more than the back. I don't know why, and nah, I guess in a way it really doesn't, but I like working on the front of my hair first, so yeah. Now I'm going to use this Shea Moisture Curl Stretch Pudding, and I like this product because it's supposed to help with shrinkage, and while I feel you can't fully get rid of shrinkage, because you know, shrinkage is so disrespectful, it definitely does help. And I'm just gonna rub this in my hair from root to end. Now I'm going to use the Shea Moisture Curl Enhancing Smoothie and you do not understand how much I love this curl enhancing smoothie. It works so good on my curls and it smells amazing. Now for me, I don't really like the way the curl stretch pudding smells that much so I kind of use the Shea Moisture Curl Enhancing Smoothie to mask the smell of the curl stretch pudding. But that's just me though, I know people that really love the way the curl stretch pudding smells. So yes, I'm going to use both. And I'm going to just rub the curl enhancer smoothie in the same way that I rubbed in the curl stretch pudding. Once that's rubbed in from root to end, I'm going to make a big fat flat twist on this section and then do the same thing to the other three sections of my hair. I don't be telling, but I tell the truth. Don't ask what I do, what I matter to you. Take off my shoes when I walk in the booth. Take off my shoes when I walk in the coop. You couldn't outdo me if you wanted to. Junior high school with the two. Couldn't go to high school with the two. Bitch, you stare at me, think I'm cool. Bend that bitch over, I'm breaking the back. Break her back in a dad new Cadillac. Shorty told me that she fall in the fast. I told her that she gotta relax. Taking a picture, she taking a video, taking my phone, making a snaps, I'm making her eat me up. No, I ain't keeping her, know that I'm deep enough, breaking her back. The drug got me sleepy, but money, it keep me up. I see him creeping, but bro, got the trap. Niggas ain't keeping up, I let them sleep with us. Only one beat because I got the bag. I'm a thug, baby, ain't no baby boy. Was ready, but I ain't the one. Balling till I'm 81. Balling, let my name LeBron. Now that my hair was nice and twisted, I like to let it sit for a little bit. For the most part, I'll let it sit while I'm getting dressed or something. If I'm in a rush, obviously it won't sit. But I like to let it sit because I feel like the curls look even better. Now I'm going to start taking the twist out in the back because I like to let the front sit for longer and I'm just going to make sure that the product is evenly distributed in the back. Wallabies. 
So I'm going to use jam today because while I was filming, I realized, clearly I couldn't get it open. While I was filming, I realized that I didn't have any equal styling gel, thanks to my dad, because he uses all of my equal styling gel. So I'm gonna use jam as I improvise. And this is just to ensure that my hair doesn't get poofy because for me, my hair always gets poofy in the middle and in the back. So this is just to make sure that it sticks. Like I said, I didn't have any equal styling gel, so I had to improvise. I wind up using mousse today, and for me, I feel like mousse and gel pretty much works the same. But I really like this mousse because it's olive oil based, so it doesn't make my hair hard, stiff, or stringy like. This actually works really good on weaves as well. Once again, this is to ensure that the middle and front of my hair doesn't get poofy or fuzzy or frizzy. It prolongs the wet look. And I'm just going to do the same thing to the front two sections as well. I don't be telling, but I tell the truth. Don't ask what I do, what I matter to you. Take off my shoes when I walk in the booth. Take off my shoes when I walk in the coop. You couldn't outdo me if you wanted to. Junior high school with the two. Couldn't go to high school with the two. Bitch, you stare at me, think I'm cool. Bad that bitch over. Okay, so off camera, I did my edges with Gorilla Snot and tied my hair down so that they can stay. And obviously, I did my makeup off camera as well. If you want to see how I got this no makeup makeup look, then comment below. And you already know, my lashes are from 626, so go follow that on Instagram and shop with her. She has bomb mink lashes for the low. Also, if you were bumping to this song playing right now, go follow at JJ Benster on Instagram. He got more heat for you. And so, this is the final look. My improvised curly hair and natural makeup get ready with me. If you want to see more videos like this, comment below. And if you don't, still comment below and tell me what you want to see next. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Thanks for tuning in, babes. Bye.